Hi everyone, this is Anne. I always love trying out new beauty products and over the last couple of months I've tried a few that I really really like and I thought I'd just do a short little video and talk a little bit more about these products because I have shown them in other videos and I'll go ahead and link those videos down in the description box beneath this video in case you want to watch those videos and see how I use them. Also, I'll write all the information that I talk about down in the description box as well, and I'll go ahead and put links to these products to where I purchased them in case you want to go on and read more about the product. I do put up one or two new videos each week, so if you like the content of my videos, please be sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not already so that you don't miss any of my videos. The first product is a donkey milk product, and I've been using donkey milk in some of my skincare products for many years. I used to order some from France, and they contain donkey milk, and then recently I ordered a couple from Amazon, and they're Korean skincare lines, and they have donkey milk in them, and what donkey milk does for your skin is it's really good for your skin. It is a lactic acid, so it's an alpha hydroxy acid that is gentle on your skin. So even people with sensitive skin can typically use a lactic acid or donkey milk product. And donkey milk is rich in vitamins A, B, C, D, E, in amino acids, and also in omega-3 and 6. What lactic acid does is it dissolves the proteins that hold the dead skin cells together on the surface of your skin. So it helps to remove those dead skin cells, revealing newer, fresher, younger looking skin. And I don't know if you've ever heard this, but Cleopatra was said to bathe in donkey milk baths as her beauty treatments. Donkey milk products can be a little bit difficult to find, so I've just been ordering some off of Amazon, and currently the ones that I'm using are Korean donkey milk products. In the past, I have ordered French donkey milk products, and the French ones seem to be a little bit more like a regular lotion or cream, and what I notice about the two Korean ones that I have, and I have a moisturizing cream, and then I also have a sleeping mask. And the sleeping mask is, it dries down really nice and then you don't, your hair doesn't stick to your face or anything like that as you sleep. And I typically use these as my very last product on at nighttime just to help seal in all the other products that I put on my skin. And again, I'll go ahead and link the video where I show how I use this beneath this video. But one thing about the Korean donkey milk products, especially the sleeping mask, is it's very like stretchy. I don't know if you can see that, but it's kind of a little bit difficult to put on because it's just kind of stretchy. But it's a very nice product and again it does dry down. It's very moisturizing and it helps to remove that dead skin off the surface of your skin. And then the next beauty product that I've been using the last couple of months and really love, would highly recommend, is a primer. And it's by Peter Thomas Roth, and this is his Skin to Die For No Filter Primer. And it's a complexion perfection type of primer where it blurs fine lines, wrinkles, and also pores. And it is slightly mattifying. So it helps to control oil throughout the day. And I start out by applying just a little bit right in the center of my face. So my chin, my nose, my forehead. And then I kind of blend that out before I apply my makeup. And it is very sheer and lightweight. It's non-greasy and it is not drying on the skin at all. It does not dry out the skin. And it does extend the wear of your makeup by quite a bit. So. I really love this product and would highly recommend it. And then I've been using the same drugstore products to keep my teeth white for many, many years. And I did do a video on what products those are, which again, I'll link beneath this video in case you're curious. But those products work really great. And I kind of wanted to see what one of these teeth whitening kits with the LED lights would do. 
So I tried one by Skin Diva, and this product is no peroxide. So it's supposed to be gentle on your gums and your teeth. And also it's vegan and cruelty free. So this kit comes with three syringes full of product, and I've used one of the syringes so far, and a portion of my second syringe. And then it has an LED light, and a tray that you attach to the LED light. And you're supposed to just put a little bit of product on the upper and lower portion of the tray and then put it in your mouth, push the button to turn it on, and it has a self timer for 10 minutes. So once the light goes out, you're done with your treatment and then I just rinse the product out of my mouth and I try to only drink water then for a little bit afterwards. And they recommend that you use six treatments for six days in a row, and it's supposed to lighten your teeth by seven shades. Well, I don't want seven shades lighter because I already have really white teeth, and they're almost like I'm using white out or something on my teeth, so I didn't want to go too white because I've always had naturally white teeth, whiter than normal teeth, and then I am always using my products to keep my teeth white and keep stains off of my teeth because I do drink coffee, tea, and soda. And so I didn't want to overly whiten them. I just wanted to see what this product would do. And so I used it two times my first week and then one time for two weeks after that. And it helps to remove stains on the inside of your teeth and also on the outside of your teeth and without the sensitivity. And I don't know if it has any sensitivity if you use it six times in a row because I have not done that. I've only used it two times in a row that first week and then one time the two weeks after. But I have not gotten any sensitivity from it. And even though I do have naturally white teeth and I keep them white by using my drugstore products that I did continue to use while I use this kit, where I noticed some improvement by using this kit, and again, I just used it four times over the last month, is at the base of my teeth. I tend to get a little bit of yellowness there, and that has improved in just the four treatments. So I think if you had more yellow toned teeth, that you wanted to lighten and you were looking for several shades lighter, this kit might be perfect because I did notice that in just four treatments, it did help to lighten that yellow area of the base of my teeth. And those are the new products that I've been using that I would highly recommend. If you guys have tried any of these products, please comment below and share your thoughts on them. Thank you so much for watching.